Now to our other top story tonight, a deadly airstrike on a Gaza hospital that leaves hundreds of people dead tonight. It comes as President Biden is on his way to Israel at this hour. This is the moment he left the U.S. This was around dinner time tonight, but the latest airstrike in Gaza is already complicating his trip. The Palestinian Health Ministry says the massive blast killed hundreds of people at a Gaza City hospital filled with the wounded and others seeking shelter. Hamas pointed blame at an Israeli airstrike, but Israeli Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu said an analysis shows the explosion was caused by Islamic Jihad rockets that misfired inside Israel. An analysis of the IDF operational systems indicates that a barrage of rockets was fired by terrorists in Gaza. After the airstrike, a senior administration leader confirmed to CBS News the president's meeting with Arab leaders in Jordan was called off, the official saying the decision was mutual. President Biden released a statement on the airstrike tonight, saying in part, I am outraged and deeply saddened by the explosion. The United States stands unequivocally for the protection of civilian life during conflict. 